Mata is. Not every man really lives. Tomorrow is not promised to you. Today is what's promised to you. How are you living your life right now? When you wake up in the morning, you got to make sure you maximize the experience. When you wake up in the morning, you got to maximize the opportunity. As long as you got breath in your body, you got to pursue your life in such a way to understand that your life matters. Your life is important. Your life is critical and we need you on this earth. You got a gift that we need. Are you living life like you got it all figured out? Are you living your life like you arrived? What are you going to do about the life you have? This life that you have been given, this life that you are temporarily holding on to, this life that has been just given to you for only temporary reasons has more meaning than you can ever imagine. This ain't it, man. This is part of the journey. This is not it. This is just a pit stop. This is not the final destination. This is just a point on the journey. But you got to put your head up high and you got to understand your legacy matters. Your legacy is important. And when you wake up every single morning, you got to live like your breath is about to leave your body. You got to live like this day is your last day. Every single day, you got to maximize everything on the inside of each and every day. That's when you're alive. So many people out there in this world right now will try to tell you not to be something that you feel in your heart that you want to be. Do not let anyone validate your purpose. Do not let anyone validate your destiny. You are not done. You have power right now. You have strength right now. Because this world needs your purpose. And so every day you gotta give it up. Every day you gotta give this world what you got. Every day you gotta give everything you got to this world because that defines your legacy. What are you gonna leave behind when your kids reach back in the past and they yell stick? What are you gonna leave for your son? What are you leaving for your daughter? Are you gonna leave your kids integrity? Are you gonna leave them honor? Are you gonna leave them a good name? Are you gonna leave them a house? Are you gonna leave them some money? What are you gonna leave when they yell stick? Never give up, keep reaching. And no matter the losses, no matter the circumstances, you don't give up on your life. You keep living, you keep fighting. What is your purpose? Why are you here? What are you supposed to do? You know what you're supposed to do. I need you to do it. Your family needs you to do it. Your next generation needs you to do it. Everybody dies but not everybody lives. Live, my friend. Live, my friend. Live. Everybody dies sooner or later. And don't worry about your death. Worry about your life. Take charge of your life for as long as it lasts. There are so many people in this world that don't believe in you. But while you're sitting around worrying about people believing in you, why don't you focus on believing in yourself? Your purpose is easy to you. Your purpose comes natural for you. Your purpose brings you energy. Your purpose brings you life. Other people are marveled by your talents and your abilities. But you look back at them and you say it's not a big deal because this is just who I am. It's not a big deal because this is my gift. It comes easy to me. It comes easy for me. Why? Because this is my purpose. Once you discover your purpose, it's your job to live with passion. That's when you're passionate. That's when you're ready to go to that next level. You determine your legacy. It's up to you. Your legacy is in your hands as long as you can breathe, as long as you can hear, as long as you can see. There's somebody out there right now that is hurting. 
There's somebody out there right now that is struggling. There's somebody out there right now that's got it a little bit tougher than you do. But you got the right to celebrate the life. No matter if it's good or if it's bad. Nothing is greater than living. Because if you're living, there's a possibility to change something. But not just change it, evolve it. Evolve it to something greater. When I think about a person who lives with passion, who's living their best life, I think about a lion who's a king of the jungle. That lion is living his best life. That lioness is living her best life. Why? Because every day they wake up with purpose. Every day they wake up with passion. Every day they see that gazelle and they pursue. Everybody dies, but not everybody lives. When I think about your life, I think about your legacy. There's no better illustration than a track meet. You ever been to a track meet? Jam packed, four by 100 relay. These athletes are stretched out. These athletes are warming their body. These athletes get into the block and the gun goes off, pow! And the first athlete comes out. He runs at 100 meters as fast as he can for 100 meters. And then he yells, stick! And then his teammates begin to take off running, but they reach back into their past. They reach back into their history. They reach back behind them and they grab their baton and they run 100 meters as hard as they can, as fast as they can. And then they yell, stick. And that next athlete must reach back into her past. She got to understand who her mama was. She got to understand who her dad was. She got to understand where she came from. He got to understand where he came from. He got to reach back into that past just a little bit to understand what kind of foundation is there. And when you grab that baton, you can't drop it. When you grab that baton, you can't fumble it. If you drop the baton, you hurt your family. If you drop the baton, you hurt your legacy. You gotta make a clean handoff from one generation to the next. And when you get that baton in your hand, you gotta run as hard as you can, as fast as you can. My friend, if you can hear my voice right now, my friend, if you can see me right now, you are alive and that baton is in your hand. And one day you gotta yell, stick. So you gotta get your son ready. You gotta get your daughter ready. But right now, the baton is in your hand. You get to choose how you live. There are going to be so many different things that you will embark on. There are going to be so many different things that's going to try to slow you down. There are going to be so many different challenges that you must face. But instead of running away from the challenge, run towards the challenge. So many people out there right now are miserable. And they'll try their best to take you with them. Do not let misery control the life that you have. Do not let anyone tell you how to live it. No matter what you have going on in your life right at this moment, keep living. Because through the pain, you can bring forth your passion. Let it resonate through your soul, through your veins, and your mind and press on my pain will always be my passion i know that i have life yet to live for my mother and father i will live for my wife and children i will live for those that trust and believe in me i will live 